What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on Gala Games token. And on today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are now and how we get there. Then we'll continue with the fundamental news that potentially might drive the price of this coin. And at the end of this video, I will share my thoughts and my technical analysis. And I will show you what should we expect next. And before we get into all of that, if you guys would like to earn two free stocks with Mumu valued up to $7,000, please check out that link in the description below. All you have to do is sign up for an account and deposit as little as $1. This is guaranteed free money. Full details you can see on the screen right now. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video right here at this very point uh, when we hit uh, the second support line. As you can see, it was uh, the support line from previous swing low. And I've told you that uh, if you want to catch the trade, uh, I didn't encourage you to do so, because uh, we hadn't any confirmation about uh, the potential movement to the upside. And uh, I've told you that uh, most likely with the lack of volume, we might see the continuation of this downtrend. And on top of that, we had a major sell-off uh, across the entire crypto uh, market. And that's why we had this massive, massive uh, a movement to the downside for more than 20% to our current range. So, uh, congratulations to all of you who follow my channel and who didn't enter your long position right here. Uh, basically, you saved your money. And uh, right here, as you can see, we have very good uh, confluence with our major golden pocket. And I will show you what should we expect next in my technical analysis. But for now, let's continue with the total sentiment for entire crypto market. As you can see, we are still uh, losing uh, the momentum, the market is going south. The total market cap for now is uh, 2.05 uh, trillion dollars. It is a decrease of 1.85% over the last day. And as you can see, major cryptocurrencies are still in red uh, on a 24 hours period and uh, on the 7 days period. So, we are in downtrend and uh, a lot of pain for now surrounding the markets, uh, not only the crypto market, but also the traditional stock market as well. And let's continue with the uh, Gala numbers. For now, it has a total market cap of 2.4. Uh, 43 billion dollars it is lower than it had previously for about 7.4 percent and the total tradable volume is 653.85 million dollars it's also lower for about 10 percent not more than 10 percent and i have to say that uh, uh, everything for now is losing its momentum and is losing its value and uh, it is what it is, we just have to be prepared for these uh, high volatility times and we have to be prepared for these uh, potential sell-offs. So let's continue with the Gala news. We are on their official Twitter page and we don't have much news related to the fundamentals of uh, this uh, coin. Uh, one of them is right here, it is a retweet from NFT Weeks Tokyo and uh, it says uh, leading blockchain game company Gala Games, first event in Japan. Please come to the event if you are in the Ginza, Tokyo area. And here is the time and the address. So, I think uh, it might be some kind of catalyst, but I don't think that it might drive the price drastically for the upcoming days. And I have to say that uh, all in all, it is quite good event, because the more people know about uh, this uh, asset, the more exposure this asset has and uh, more and more new customers, potential customers, might be added to this uh, network. So, and uh, let's continue with the general news. Uh, if you type uh, in Google search bar Gala Games News, uh, we still don't have uh, any news at all related to this company. We have two news and uh, it is not directly related to the fundamentals of Gala Games. Uh, it is uh, related to Excite Labs and uh, it is uh, related to their recent uh, conference that uh, took place uh, at the beginning of December in Las Vegas on December 11th. And I have to say that's it. We don't have any news at all. And uh, this means uh, we still have uh, more exposure on this asset from the total sentiment uh, for the crypto industry. 
And uh, let's continue with the technical analysis, but before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So guys, first of all, as you can see, we broke uh, this support line and this means uh, our targets are pretty much invalidated. We don't need this tool, we don't need this tool as well and our targets uh, are not valid for now. We have to delete them as well. So. And what should we expect next? As you can see, we are hovering uh, right uh, around the golden pocket range. And uh, uh, technically from this top, uh, let me show you without any tools, uh, we have consistently lower highs and lower lows because we broke uh, this previous support line and we are hovering below this range. This means uh, we hit exactly the range of golden pocket. It is the most uh, probable level of trend reversal, but we still have to be cautious because the sentiment for the entire crypto industry is not so favorable for next bull runs. And uh, let me add to this price chart the price, the Bitcoin price. And right here, uh, let me change the color of uh, this line. So as you can see, uh, price, the gala price is mimicking the price of Bitcoin, but it has a much higher volatility compared to Bitcoin. And it is quite obvious for these type of assets that has not so huge uh, market cap. And this means we still have to be cautious, but the upside potential, in my opinion, in these type of uh, minor coins related to metaverse, if the metaverse itself will continue its growth, these assets might be extremely, extremely profitable. And that's why we have to be cautious. So what should we expect next? In my opinion, uh, we don't have uh, for now enough confirmation to enter our swing trade position and basically to catch any trades because for now adding the position for the short period of time is basically catching a falling knife. This means I don't encourage you to enter your medium term uh, and sw basically swing trade position at this very range. But if you want to invest in this asset and you already done your own due diligence and you know that these type of assets might be extremely beneficial in the future when the metaverse uh, will expand its uh, presence uh, on the virtual markets. This means uh, you can accumulate your position all the way down. For now it hits uh, the golden pocket range and uh, potentially you might have a small bounce to the upside. And uh, next uh, range where we might land is right here. It is uh, the 0 0.786 uh, Fibonacci retracement level. And it is the price point, let me show you, it is the price point of uh, about uh, 0 0.23 uh, dollars. And uh, I have to say that if we will break it uh, to the downside, if we will break the range of uh, about uh, 34 cents to the downside with the huge increase in volume, and as you can see for now this movement to the upside has decent increase in volume, we will uh, definitely have a possibility to hit this range. But for now, on a 4 hours time frame, if I take a look uh, on the uh, indicators, we have uh, bullish divergence. And uh, this divergence means that uh, we might have uh, a small pullback or even a trend reversal. And uh, this uh, divergence uh, is the pattern when you can see lower lows on the price section with the higher lows on our side. And on top of that, we have uh, uh, this uh, range as well on the MACD. So this asset is losing its negative momentum. And when it starts to tick to the upside, we will have uh, more buying power with this asset. And this will lead to potential at least a bounce. So I think uh, from the technical standpoint, that's it for now. And if you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye.